Why do you say that alcohol is the worst drug out there? So in the UK, alcohol is the most harmful drug to the UK because it's so widely used. It's not the most harmful drug to the user. I mean, you know, if you, if you, there are other drugs which are going to be are more dangerous. I mean, heroin, fentanyl, crack mm. cocaine, spice, they're more harmful to you as a user. But thankfully, they're not widely used. But alcohol is so widely used that I bet every family in the country is affected one way or the other by alcohol, either through someone drinking too much or someone being damaged by a drunk driver or getting into a fight mm. or something. And it's legal, of course. And it is absolutely legal, and pretty much every other drug isn't. So the only drug you can use to relax yourself or to, to enjoy a, a social occasion that's legal is alcohol. And, and that, actually, that's wrong, I think. You'd say now, if it was invented today, it would be declared an illegal drug. It would be if we applied the same criteria as we currently apply. That's right. And, and would it be class C? No, it would be probably B. It would be a class B it drug. It would be a class B drug, yes. It's on the threshold of A and B in terms of the harm to the user. Yeah. But it's, it's also about the cost, not only to the individual, but to the country as a whole. Yes. But also it's a big uh, generator mm -hmm. of finance for governments, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So this is the card that the alcohol industry plays all the time. It says, look, you know, we contribute 20 billion in taxes and we provide a lot of jobs. <coughs> and that is true. But then on the other side of the equation, you know, it's three and a half billion in healthcare costs, six and a half billion in policing costs, 20 billion in lost uh, production from hangovers and things. So the net balance is all, it's- It's a debt, it's isn't a it? Debt. It's a debt. It's we, a debt that approaches around 20 billion, billion pounds. That's yeah. right. So all taxpayers are paying that much in order to allow them to do what they do, which is to drink as they want to drink. And I always think it's a bit hard on those people who don't drink at all because they're forced to pay their taxes and subsidize the drinking of those who do. Drink.